Hello everyone. Welcome to Unshackling Sudokus and Puzzles. I'm here to solve an outside 234 Sudoku created by Clover. Clover is an excellent author. Uh, nothing needs to be mentioned more than that. It's as simple as that. Uh, I saw the Sudoku on the CTC Discord server and uh, this Sudoku is also present in uh, the round one of Sudoku Grand Prix 2023 uh, which is starting this weekend. Uh, which is starting on Friday to be precise. I will also uh, add a link to the Grand Prix on World Puzzle Federation so that you can give it a try. So this is a lower pointer. I think it's 42 points during the contest. But this particular Sudoku, uh, as mentioned by the author, uh, may be harder. So this is a live solve. So let's see how it goes. Uh, you'll find the link to solve this in the description. Let's move into the rules now. Each row, each column and 3x3 box in the grid has digits 1 to 9, no repetition. And clues given outside must be present in the 2nd, 3rd or 4th cells in that row or column from the direction of the clue. It's as simple as that. So for example, if you look at the bottom of the grid, we have 1, 7 uh, under box 7. So which means 1 and 7 must be going in these three cells because they are the second, third and fourth cell from when looking from that direction. Similarly, when you look on the right of the grid, we have 3, 7 outside box 3, which means 3, 7 must be in these three cells. So this is how the rules work. They must be present in the second, third or fourth cells when looking from that direction. So let's start the Sudoku now. Okay, 3, 4 is in here, in these cells. So do we just blindly write all these digits and then look or just look for something right from the start? Okay, so let's look for right, something right from the start. See if we get something. So I have 2, 3 here. So this will be 2, 3. And these will be 1, 2. So I've got my quote of two twos for boxes uh, two and box five, which means the two for column five must go into these three cells. Okay. And also I know that two must be in one of these two cells because you can't have both the twos here. So two must go one here. But the challenge is how to, you know, remember that or how to even mark that. Anyway, let's think about that later. Okay, let's look at this cell guys. Because I'm seeing 1, 2 on the left side, 5, 6 on the right side, 8, 9 on the top and 3, 4 at the bottom. So this cell cannot be anything from 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 8, 9. So that's a 7. That's a clever way to force something. So which means if I, I need to look for 7s around the grid. Look at 7, 8 on the right of the grid. So 7 must be in these two cells. 7 can't go here anymore, so 7 goes here. And there is also 7 at the bottom of the grid, 6, 7. 7 must be here. And that gives ah, 7 in one of these two cells. Because you have a 7 here, 3, 7. And which means 7 must go into one of these cells. You can't have 7 here. Wow, I also have a 7 in these three cells. Which means I can't have 7 here, I can't have 7 here, so 7 goes here. Beautiful, guys. This is a 7. And that gives a 7 here, so that's a 7. And which means 1 must be in one of these two cells, looking at the bottom clue. And 8 must be in one of these two cells, looking at the right clue, 7, 8. And I also know that 8, 9 is outside uh, box 6. So 8 must be in these 3 cells. 8 must be in these 2 cells. So 8 goes here. Very nice. What do I look for next? Ah, I have a 3 in these 2 cells. Uh, because of the clue given outside, 3 must be in these 2 cells, which means... I eliminate the 3 from these two cells. So there is a 3 here and a 3 here. Like I said, the challenge is to 
remember all these data pencil marks so many pencil marks okay looking at the four five clue outside box four four must be in these two cells because you can't have a four here four must go in these two cells Uh, I'm looking at the 1, 8, loop. oh, I have a 7 in these 3 cells, right? So which means I can resolve this 7. This should have been done at the start. I missed that. So which means 7 goes here uh, because of the 3, 7 clue. And now for the bottom 1, 7 clue outside uh, box 7, there must be a 7 in these 3 cells that pushes the 7 here. So I think it's wise to focus on 7s for now. So using classic I get the 7 in row 9 and 7 in row 4 goes into these two cells and 1 goes into these two cells because of the 1 7 clue. 3 goes into these two cells because of the 3 7 clue outside box 7 and you can't have 3 here right 3 is looking at that so that's a 3 so i wish i could highlight these clues we'll know which ones we have used but there's no way to highlight those you can't select any of the clues outside okay what next okay there is a 2 in these 3 cells now look at the 1 2 clue outside box 5 box 4 sorry 2 must be going go in these 3 cells and you have a 2 here so 2 goes here and 6 goes in these 2 cells you can't have a 6 here because of the 6 7 uh, at the bottom so 6 goes here Okay, 3, 4 clue at the top of box 3. T must be here. You can't have 3 here because you have a, a domino of 3s in here. So which means you can't have 3 in here. So 3 must go here. You also can't have a 3 here. The reason is, just imagine having a 3 in this red cell. Now for the 3, 7 clue outside box 3, you must have a 3 here. And now the uh, 3, 4 clue outside box 1 and the three, 2, 3 clue outside box 2 are getting spoiled, right? You can't have 4 3s in uh, 3 rows, as simple as that. Which means you can't have 3 here, so this is a 3. And we have resolved this clue as well. And 4 goes in one of these two cells. And I have a 3, 4 outside row 4 on the left side. So this is not 4, that's a 4 and that removes 4 from here. So I have 4 in these two cells. Okay, so I have an 8 here. I also have an 8 here, which means I must have one of the 8s in these two cells, right? Because for this area and this area, you must have two 8s. And this area takes one eight and this area takes another eight, which means for the eight line, eight nine clue outside column five, there must be an eight here. So you get an eight here now because eight can't be here. So eight goes here. And similarly, nine also can't go here because of the eight nine clue outside row four on the right side. So nine goes here as well, considering the eight nine clue outside column five. So you get an eight nine pair. This is a really nice Sudoku guys, very nice Sudoku.
Okay. Look at the 1 8 blue outside box 9 in row 8. 1 must be in these 3 cells. You cannot have 1 here because of this. And you can't have 1 here because you have made a pencil mark of 1 here. And by you I mean myself. So this cannot be 1. This has to be a 1. And that gives 8 in these 2 cells. Uh, using the clue on the right of the grid. And which means you have an 8 here, you have an 8 here. So 8 is not in these two cells. That gives 8 here. Beautiful. So I'm making some progress in column 8. It's not so easy uh, looking at so many clues. The 3, 4 clue outside column 5. 3 must be in these two cells. You have a 3, 4 here and 3 can't be here. 3 goes here. How much time have we taken? Okay, close to 11 minutes. Not bad. Ah, 8 is no more here because of this 8. So 8 goes here and 8 goes here. Very nice. I have an 8 here. I have an 8 here. So using classic, I can place my 8s here. Okay, 6, 7 clue outside column 6. 6 has only one cell now. This must be a 6. Okay. Okay, 2 in row 6 must go here. Because you have a 2 here. Right, you also have two in one of these two cells because of the clues outside columns four and six. You have two here, you have a two here due to the clue outside uh, row five, the one two clue. So that gives two in these cells. Hmm. Ah, six now must be in these three cells due to the clue given outside, and that gives six here. You can't have 6 here, so 6 goes here, and which means I can place the 4 now. 6 goes here, 4 can't go here, so 4 goes here, and that removes 4 from here, and that gives 4 for these clues. This is a 4. Excellent. Beautiful, guys. I'm getting some progress. And now 5 can be placed for these 3 cells, so this is a 5. 1 can be placed for these cells, this is 1. Okay. Ah, look at this cell. Can't be 4, 8, 9, cannot be 3 and 7, cannot be 6 and cannot be 5 because of the 5, 6 clue at the bottom. So this can only be 1 or a 2 and that is interesting because now we are sure that both of these cells cannot be 1 and 2 because that would violate this cell so this cell has to be 1 and 2 and which means that the 8 9 clue on outside row 4 has to be a 9 uh, has to take a 9 here that's really beautiful wow a really enjoyable sudoku and i can place a 5 here because of the clue outside so 5 goes here this is 2 or 4, can't be 1, 6, 8, cannot be 3, 5, 7, cannot be 9, so this is 2 or 4. Ah, now look at the 3, 4 clue outside row 4. 4 can't go here, 4 is forced here. And 3 now must be in this domino, 3 cannot be here, 
because uh, you have a 3, so that's a 3. And the reason 3 must be in this domino is because of the clue outside. So 3 goes here. And now uh, these 3 cells must take a 3 because of the 3 clue outside. And you have 1, 2 here and 4 here. So that's a 3. And now I get my 7 using classic. That's a 7. And that puts 7 using classic in one of these 2 cells. And 5 can be placed in these 3 cells now because of the clue outside. That's a 5. So I think we have almost got every clue. Uh, which ones haven't we looked at? Okay, this 5, 6 is not clear. Okay, 4 is in one of these two cells because of the clue outside and which means I can make use of that and place a 4 in box 2. We have 4 here, so 4 is forced here. Wow, look at this area. It's just a mess. But we need to make use of those. Look at this cell now. 6, 7, 8. And, uh, oh, my mouse has lost power, guys. Damn. Uh, I hope it comes into power. Just give me a moment. I'm unable to move my mouse now. Is it moving? Just says connection lost. Let me try this now. It's just not coming. When things go bad, they go bad together. I should have charged this, guys. The problem is that when you have an Apple iMac, except for the video clarity, it's a completely useless uh, iMac because once you charge the mouse, it looks something like this and you can't move the mouse. Ah, just hold on, guys. I wish I could get a few moments of charge to complete the Sudoku. I'm sorry for this, really. Let's see if it's moving now. Ah, thankfully, I hope that's enough charge to finish the Sudoku. Okay, look at this cell. 6, 7, 8 and 1, 2, 4. So this is 3, 5, 9. And you cannot have 5 here because 5 is in this domino. So that's a 3, 9. And now... Not so easy. Must be surely some interesting mark we are missing here. Okay, three can be placed in column one using classic. Nothing to explain there. And look at this cell. This is 5 or a 6. Reason is you have 3, 8, 9 here, a 4 and 7 here, and a 1, 2 pair between these 3 cells, which means this will be 5 or a 6. Okay, 9 is looking down at this column. So there must be a 9 in these two cells. And that combined with this 9 gives me a 9 here. And now I can do something along row 6. This is 1 or 3. 
and these two cells are 1, 2, 3. What am I missing? Ah, this guy, this guy. You should have done it long back. Two must be in these three cells. So that's a two. So this is why I wish I could mark the clues outside because if you mark the clues outside, you can always focus on clues which aren't yet spent. That's a two. And that means in these three cells, this is a two. That gives one here. And six is staring down at those two, two cells, which means six has exactly one uh cell left in that box and that these two can be completed five can't go here so that's a one that's a five and now along column six i have a three nine pair okay let's look at this cell this row six eight and nine let's mark in those six eight nine let me quickly check my time. Okay, I have a 5 here. So 5 is not here, which means in box 5, 5 goes here. And that gives 5 in these two cells because of the clue outside. You must have a 5 in these three cells. And this becomes a 5 6 pair now. And now 4 in box 6 has only one cell left. That's a 4. And this is a naked single. Can't be 4, 5, 6, 9, 6, 7, 8, 9, 2, 1, 3. So that's a 1. That becomes a 2, 3 pair. That gives a 1 here. And now the 3, 4 clue outside forces these two cells. You must have 3, 4 here. And that's a 3 and that's a 4. And now 2 goes here due to classic. And this 3 gives a 9 here, gives a 3 here, gives 9 here. This is a 6-7 pair. And look at row, row 8. This is a hidden single, can't be 1, 4, 6, 8, 3, 7. That's not a 2-9, so that's a 5. So I have a 2-9 pair finishing off row 8 and this is 1 8 and that can be completed because of this one that's 1 that's 8 this is a gorgeous creation guys so much fun to solve this Urubu. can't explain really so that's 4 because of classic 4 goes in these two cells so look at these cells, I'm just going to make use of classic 1, 2, 8, that's not a 1. And you also know 2 must be in these two cells because of the clue outside, so that's not a 2. And 1 must also be in these two cells because of the clue outside, so I have a 2 here and a 1 here, so that means this is 8. And this is 1, this is 2, you have 1 here and that resolved that. 1 in these two cells gives me 1 here, classic, gives 7 here, gives 6, 7, 8, 9 gives me 6 in here, this is 8, 9, and I need 2, 8, 9 in this area, 2 is staring down at those cells, so that's a 2, which means this will be 8 and 9. That completes column 2. Pardon me if I'm going a bit fast here. But I'm not sure when my mouse will stop uh, working again. Charge is low. So 9 is here. So this is a 2. That's a 9. And 2, 5, 7, 1, 3, 4, 6. So this is an 8, 9 pair. So 8 goes here and 9 goes here. And this is a 4, 5 to complete the column 1. Okay, row 3 can be completed. This is 2, 1, 6. Okay. And 3 in row 9 has only one cell. Has to be here. 
and that resolves this 3 2 that resolves this 2 6 which resolves this 6 5 and let's complete column 7 now that's a 1 that's an 4 that's a 4 okay that finishes of this this is 4 this is 5 and 5 goes here 1 8 9 3 4 5 7 so 6 goes here 2 goes here and just we can rush through the sudoku now 5 8 9 8 and 9 and with that i have completed this beautiful creation by clover wonderful sudoku nothing short of a wonderful sudoku this would certainly be uh, you know difficult uh, than the gp not that i've given the gp yet nobody would have given the gp yet it's yet to start but thing is that the gp sudoku is 42 points and the one which we which i saw now is certainly worth more than 42 points but thanks for watching and thanks to clover for creating this wonderful sudoku we'll see you soon bye bye